We need Shadur Sanders. I just want to roll it, roll it, roll it with a dagger wrench. We out here. Ain't no Titans fans to be seen. Did the Titans even have it to you? I don't know. I didn't hear anything. Did they say anything? Go Titans go or tighten up? They did some grunting at one point. No idea past that. <laughs> Welcome, NFL fans, to Fango Media, where we put you, the fan, first. My name is Nolan Dollahan, host of Nashville Fango. We are outside of Nissan Stadium, where the Packers took down the Titans 30-14. to This is my partner, Jeremy, and we're going to find out what's going on on the scene today. How do people think about the Titans? What do they think about the Packers? Malik Willis, revenge game? Let's find out. Fango Nashville. My name is Jeremy Gruen, resident Titans fan, apparently, even though they are garbage. And uh, we asked a lot of fans out here today thinking um and you'll get it right after this so stay tuned hell yeah i got preston smith's gloves what's up oh, wait how'd that happen i just was up, i was in the second row we got up there i, I said preston how many guys have preston smith jersey on That's in right. tennessee me right and you so said I, you look I, like a d-lineman yourself like I you was, could maybe play backup dm I, well, it was a great game today it was great fans great atmosphere i really appreciate the nissan stadium in the, in the city of nashville and giving us everything. Very grateful man. A very grateful man from Evansville, Indiana. What's going on with the what's going on with the Titans? 0 3. How are we feeling about Will Levis? What's going on? We need Shadur Sanders. I'm I'm at the Ooh, point now. We sound perfect timing. Mr. Perfect Timing. We can't I mean, I don't understand what's going on. Sound New bike. coach. We got to spend all this money in the offseason and we're 0 3. It's just oh, doesn't matter. Go. 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 Go, Pat, go, go, Pat, go. Hey, best traveling, best traveling fans in the in the NFL. It sure looks like it. Maybe I do want to get back to that Shador Sanders point. That's what you want? Yes. Maybe I mean, Levis is just it's too risky. It's high risk, high reward, and it's always high risk. There's no reward to what he does. Absolutely. He needs to get rid of the ball quicker, but when he does, it's a fumble. It's a throw to the other team. It doesn't make any sense. The O-line sucks. We have the number one ranked defense. Then a 30? Was it 30 to well, 14? Yeah, giving away points. Yeah. I mean, how many? This is I right. agree. Three huge turnovers. The pick six today. Go and we back, gave a fumble in game two, and then the pick six in game one. And we forced only three punts today, I believe. It. It's, ridic it's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. We lost to the guy who was our practice practice squad quarterback. That's how sad this franchise is. That's got to hurt. That's got to hurt. That's got to hurt. Let's go to the 2025 draft. Travis Hunter, Shador Sanders will be a Titan. Well, you heard it here first. Titans getting Shador Sanders and Travis Hunter. Book it. Any thoughts on Malik Willis coming back to his hometown and kicking butt? Bro, that's the dog right there. That's, that's the bro. That's, that's the what bro. we came here for. Came here for Malik? I, I tell you what, it's all coaching. Yeah? Yeah, exactly. Came for Jordan State you, you for Malik. Malik Dude, for two brother, years you got nothing with him. There's no quarterback controversy, but Malik has filled the job, and we got two wins with him. So, you know what? Jordan Love. Back next week against the Vikings. Jaden Reed. How are we feeling about Jaden Reed? I mean, the guy's a stud. And you know what? Watson could go off at any time. Reed could go off at any time. And even Wicks could slip in there, too. I, I love the fact that we we don't know who to cover. You don't know who to cover when you're playing the Packers on the on the passing side. So that's why when Jordan comes back, the, the playbook's wide open. It's going to be fun. Yeah. Any thoughts on Will Levis staying the starting quarterback for the Titans? You know, I, I feel for him. He's young. The NFL has a problem with this. Out of college, they start these kids right out of college. They got to give them on the bench, get a veteran in there to teach them, and then they're going to get better. They got to they gotta see it from a different angle before they just throw them in there to play. Yeah. yeah. They, the, yep. the Panthers already gave up on Bryce Young. Any thoughts on that? I know. And, you know, Bryce is a good quarterback. And, you know, I think that's why Carolina won't trade him because he just needs to learn the speed of the game and all that stuff. It's so much different than the college game. So many of these scouts miss on that. And you see it all the time uh, with a lot of – look at Caleb Williams. Yeah, he's struggling again today. Put yeah. him on the bench. Put him on the bench. Let him learn. Let him learn, you know. But, oh, well, hey, you learn when you th throw a kid in the water that doesn't want to swim. That's what they're doing. Yep, that's yep. right. That's just a sad day to be a Titans fan. Sad day to be a Titans fan. Gain some composure. Got to get some more repeats in there. He's got to get on the line. The guy's got to start blocking because he's getting too much pressure. Once that's over with, I think we'll be making our way. We started off bad in Chicago. We're here today. We lost at home. We've got to get better. Yeah, I'm hearing a lot of offensive line trouble is going on today. That's exactly what the problem is. Somebody's got to block, but Will's got to still hold the ball. Yeah, he's got a strong arm, but maybe a sort of rookie a football IQ maybe in the game. You know, and, and it's sad because we really thought he was more of a veteran and had strong play when it comes to making good plays like that. So Kentucky's a little different than being in the pros, and we're just having to go through the rough times. Well, we'll get there, and we're going to stick our heads up. So you think they should stick with Will Levis going forward? Uh, I'm not GM, but my name's Jim. But <laughs> Jim, but not GM, he says. I'm not GM, 
but I do think we're going to have to stick it out because we've let people like Malik Willis go. We've let people like Julio Jones go. You've got to stop letting players go that really can make the team. So let's build some. Any thoughts on the signing of Calvin Ridley, though? He's looking pretty good, pretty sharp. Calvin, I love Calvin. He's out there. He's doing his thing. He is going to make the game fun for us yeah. and that's all i can say about him he's a fun player to watch good god that was an amazing game malik is awesome jordan love i hope he got a job in the future malik's killing no tom brady drew bledsoe situation brewing oh i i'm seeing it i'm seeing it it could be i mean jordan love the million dollar man 300 million dollar man something like that but malik's playing pretty good football great football great malik football. willis running throwing the Jordan whole thing Really? I think Jordan Love is nervous. Wow. We're pulling for you, Jordan, but I'm glad we got Willis on the, on the range right now. We're, we're worried. We're worried. Absolutely. You know, when uh, when Love went down, I wasn't sure what it was going to look like. The Packers were able to get, to get their footing and whatnot, but, I mean, it's looking pretty good. It's looking real good, and the defense is phenomenal. Alexander with the pick six. Yes. Oh, pick six. That was awesome. See, having him play well is so big. Crazy, half of us. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. The other half, not so much. How many uh, Packers fans are in there? What do you think it's split? About seventy-five percent. Really? That's what it looks like out here because we can be interviewing Titans fans as well, but I don't see any. I don't see any Titans fans. No Packers fans. See, I'm out here. We're supposed to be doing both, but I only see Packers fans. Titans fans are all home licking their wounds. Willis is fantastic. <laughs> right? I like to look to see Love and Willis kind of go it. Sure. Right? They'll, they'll they'll do a little New Orleans Saints thing. Absolutely. Can you believe we have a little bit of a QB controversy brewing right no, after we... No, no. Love is the quarterback. Absolutely. Willis is going to fill in with those run things and, you know, mix it up and make some plays. Fantastic. Love is the guy. Willis will fill in. It's always it's nice. It's fantastic. Too. It's always nice. He's in this league. You never know when someone's going to go down. We're very lucky. Absolutely. Very blessed. We are like disappointed with Will Levis. Disappointed with Will Levis. Should we move on? Uh, I think it's too early for that. Yeah, he's got to calm down in the pocket. Okay. I think he's got to take less time when he throws the ball. Okay, I hold think on. He's, I think he's rushing it. Rushing it. So, okay. Yeah. How about Tony Pollard and Calvin Ridley? How about those new signings? I mean, they got to click with Levis. Uh, with Levis doesn't click, they don't click. He yeah. sets he sets the tone for all of them. So yeah. Seems like the defense is kind of keeping them in games though, and the offense is not producing. Would you agree? Disagree? Absolutely, one hundred percent. Best defense in the league statistically coming into week two, and uh, yeah, just disappointed. Yeah, Lejarius Seed looks good. Especially when you're here with a bunch of Packer fans. Oh, we're here with a yeah. bunch of house divided over here? <laughs> or just friends? Or what do we got over here? Not, not house divided. Not house divided. Thoughts on Malik Willis coming back, taking the dub against his former team? Uh, it's a, rent, a revenge game. He was revenge uh, game. he was happy to be here and uh, he was happy to uh, win this game. Yeah. Yeah. Any uh, any appreciation for like Jaden Reed, Dontavian Wick, some of the newer guys that are really showing out for the Packers lately? I'd go Jaden Reed. I mean, uh, due to speeds there. It's, about a jet sweep, he's gone. All right, well, you heard it here first from a bunch of Titans fans, a bunch of Packers fans. A bunch of people really happy with Will Levis, some not so much. They may be want to move on. A bunch of people ecstatic about Malik Willis's comeback performance today. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment, and hit that notification bell to check out Fango in the future so that you can catch us on all Titans home games. We got the next game is the Titans playing at home versus the Colts division rivalry against Anthony Richardson. So make sure you check in here how the fans are thinking about the Titans' performance in the next coming weeks. Dolphins Monday night game, and then the Colts at home Sunday, October 13th. Anything to say, Nolan? I think you pretty much wrapped it up. We wrapped it up. Let's go.